So we've got two strips of tape um, with no sharp corners, so the rounded off edges at the end. The top quarter has been bent over, okay, like so. And what I now need to do is rip along the area of the backing paper. That's one. And they're going to do it on the second one, like so. That's two. Now we're going to apply the tape. So what we need is the, the, the muscle in a stretch position. So we're going to ask the patient to bend right forward. So we put the, the muscles on a stretch. We're going to deactivate. So we're going to um, take off the backing paper. We're going to put it at the base of the muscle, like so. Perfect. And then we're going to take off the backing paper. So the base has got no stretch on it at all. I'm now going to apply a 50% stretch up the back extensors. And it's important now to activate the glue. So it sticks better, because what you're going to try and do is probably use this for sport or for walking around. And what you want to do is try and make sure it stays on. So that's one. The second one. On the other side, again, you're just going to place the base onto the bottom of the muscle with no stretch in it at all. And then we're going to take the backing paper off again and we're going to put a bit of stretch on it, 50% stretch on it, up to there. And again, important we activate the glue. You do exactly the same in reverse when you're taking it off. So because it would have stick quite, it will stick quite quite a lot, you just rub the muscle, rub the tape again and that will deactivate the glue. Then if you get the patient to stand up, they've now got the myofascial taping in place.